It costs nothing to play, but I got something to say. Time for Nando and I. For this Nando and I, we're checking out Heroes of Legion Wood. Uh, it looks like yet another RPG Maker piece, but I kind of like the character designs. Fairly typical fantasy, but I don't know. Girl's kind of cute. It's an oddly shaped head, but kind of cute. Uh, let's just get into it. These were really hit or miss for me, but you never know. Dark Gaia Studios presents. Presents slowly, apparently. Heroes of Legion Wood. That's a lot of wood. Hello, little sprite character. Hey, I'm testing, testing, can you hear me? Yeah. Excellent, my name is Thera this year. I'm here to welcome you to Legionwood and help determine a few things before you start your journey. First of all, you need to select a gender for your character. Please keep in mind that this choice has no effect on the story. Let's be a dude. This is your character. The fate of Legionwood rests in his hands. What is his name? Uh... Oh. Actually, let's just go with the default. I'll be lock. Or Lok. Tone Lok. Funky Cold Medina, right here. His name is Lok, is this correct? Next, you must choose a character class. This will determine your character's abilities and growth pattern. Just select an option, I'll tell you more. Give me guns. The getter's a powerful range fighter. That's fine, except. Wait up here, you're gonna be a gunner. You're a gunner, Harry. Now you must spend your starting pool of stat points to select your character skills. To spend a stat point, just highlight one of your character's attributes and press either enter or the left mouse button. That's kind of annoying. Um, attack. Okay, oh, enter as in the confirm key. 17 feels good. A little bit more magic defense. A little bit of magic. Speed. Uh, luck. And more attack. More speed. Gotta go fast. Okay. To purchase skills, choose their text. They don't tell you you hit cancel to go back after you're done that. But you have to hit cancel to go back after you're done that. Purchase skills. You choose learn text if you have a list of available skills. If you have enough AP, your character can purchase a new skill. Um, learn text. Uh, I like flaming shot. I don't know if I have enough points for that though. Oh, I have 3 AP. Learn it. Uh, oh, and uh, critical shot. Learn it. Okay, and as I'm learning stuff, it adds other stuff. Keep in mind that you will earn more stat points and AP each time you level up, so be sure to check your care sheet often. I do kind of like that they make you level up a bit right at the beginning, so you can actually see what the leveling up is all about before you get all up into it. Finally, you have to select the difficulty level. Uh, let's go normal. That's it. Remember, you can choose it later if you wish during the op in the options menu. Okay, you're ready to go. I'll be seeing you again later. Good luck on your journey. It's kind of a time consumer, though. I don't know how far, how deep we're going to dig into this. Civilization is on the brink of extinction. Over a span of a hundred years, the force known as the darkness consumed Legion Wood. Men and beasts did not make themselves very easy to read in red text over reddish mountains. Also, they were transformed into terrible monsters and laid waste to the nations. Only one vestige of humankind remains. Confined to Alexis Island on the Aldegard Archipelago. I can't sp say archipelago? Too much alliteration. Legion Wood's last men await the end of the world. What hope could there possibly be to live through these days, these days of darkness? Somebody loves to alliterate. 
he feels there's nothing else we can do. The taint is growing worse. Taint. At this stage, you could only have a few more days at most. I trust you guys. If you say I have the taint, then I cannot argue with you. My only regret is that it may all have been for nothing. I don't understand. You need to be exposed to the darkness to contract the taint. How could you when it hasn't yet reached this island? Guess what's reached the island? It may not have reached this town, Master Blacksmith, but it is most definitely on the island. I thought that I had found a way to stop it spreading further, that's why. What is this madness, Glacius? You're selling you expose yourself intentionally? There's something that's hidden in the abandoned fort to the west of here. Something that was placed there long ago to help us defend against the darkness. Last week I received word from a friend that something important has happened. I went there on my own to retrieve it. I didn't want to raise any false hopes. You were a fool, Glacius. You couldn't find anything there. Now you're dying. But is it true? Is there really something there that could save us all? I only wish I could have searched harder before giving up. I was overwhelmed by the undead, but I am sure it is still there. Perhaps it still is. Look, I have a task for you. Go to your house and get your gear. We must find Chief Glacius' search. I finished Chief Glacius' search. Do you understand? Occasionally, you will be prompted. It's like how long I was prompted to an NPC. Casual. We'll go and beat up some undead for you, Chief. Right, guys? The main goal would be to actually locate the artifact, but yes, you will have a chance to test your metal. Different types of responses will cause different reactions from NPCs. Some NPCs may treat Locke differently depending on his attitude towards them. This may all be for nothing, but please, go and get ready. And to beat me back here, we won't let the Chief die in vain. Move Locke around the area with the wasty keys to the left mouse button. You can hold shift while moving to run. Open the menu with escape or the right mouse button. You can view your character, use skills, or save the game. I'm using arrow keys and Z and X because that's what I'm used to for RPG Maker. Just so you know, that's a viable option. One of the books catches your eye. Let's read. Modern scholars agree that the darkness is not merely a force of evil. According to ancient scriptures predating the precursor error, it is evil itself. While this force has been present in our world for less than 100 years, it has wrought changes that would have taken a millennia. For a less than divine entity. For reasons unknown, any early life that has lost the darkness is revived as the undead. Humans and animals alike are turned into horrifying monsters. Well, that sucks. Oops, something about dark taint. While this incurable sickness does not seem to affect all people, those unfortunate enough to contract it will weaken and die within days, destined to rise again as the undead. Okay. So, it's nice that they have sparkly things on interactive stuff, too. Make my life easier. Even though I'm safe sick, I shall continue to toil in his kitchen. If he only eats a hearty meal, I'm sure he will return to perfect health soon. Yeah, I'm sure that's going to do it. Alright, doing a little random checking. Doesn't need to be doing anything. I need to figure out which house is mine. Um, this is your hometown. You can talk to NPCs with the enter key or the left mouse button. Butterflies are not NPCs. You cannot talk to butterflies. Can't talk to Wells either. What's up with you? Did you know that Chief Glacius has read your large collection of history books? Most of his volumes are far too dry for me, but there are some useful books on the darkness. Every time I visit, I take the time to read a few pages. Just try to learn whatever we can about what happened to the outside world while we still have time. Hence the book I read. I can't walk around that, or around that. Oh, there's a bridge right there. Good at games, guys. Great at bridges. I'm the best. Before the darkness arrived in Legion Wood, people used to consult mystics to learn new fighting techniques and ancient arts. This day is up to us to master new attacks ourselves. Every you become a more experienced fighter, you'll, learn, you'll earn AP, which you can use to learn new abilities. Yeah. We went over that in the intro. Thanks for reminding me. Hello there, do you need to buy something? Hmm, peptides. Kudos for, you know, coming up with new names for stuff. Thank you for your patronage, please come back at a time. 
Having enough supplies to last a journey can mean the difference between life and death. You should always buy more than you think you'll need. Or we can take well more than we think we'll need. Spider silk. I'm disappointed in you, Rocco. We have better things to do to deprive other people of their possessions. Do not. Do not dare comment on my tendency to just take stuff. Oh, I think it's kind of cool that they, uh, you know, address that. Ooh, tombstone. Three tombstones. It lies me and a brother Sapphire. Who drew out of the lake? We tried to save him, but there was too much water. Yeah, that's usually how drowning works. Memory of Fox, the truth seeker. What he searched for is still out there somewhere. Realize you go, gambling man. His lucky numbers were 4, 8, 15, uh, 16, 23, 42. Seriously? You ready to travel outside of Tagget? We need to sure visit the church. The priest inside can restore your fighting condition. We need faith in times like these. So, healers in the church. Gotcha. Uh, what's your deal? Chief Glacier is still being That was found centuries ago. It's a quiet refuge uh, from the castle of Port Alexis. Is there any state of the outside world? The fact that the darkness hasn't reached here yet is a fairly peaceful place. Yep, you know it. Oh, I guess this is my house since it's going to Autumn. Hmm, Mom's sweet home. This is your house. You can rest in your bed in advance the next day or cook a meal at the stove. I like stoves. Is that the stove? Oh, that's the stove with the green thing above it. Blunderbuss and cloth all worked in. I've had a chance to use it quite a while, but not too rusty. You can use the equipment option in the uh, menu to adjust your party's weapons and armor. Try equipping locks, blunderbuss, and cloth armor now. Show a quick meal? Yes. Let's eat. Trade the spot. I'll try to get back to work. Try sleeping. You say I feel a little tired. Should I rest up for a while? Yeah. I feel much better. Let's get to work. I wonder if that's different from the church healing or what. So we got the stuff. Am I supposed to go back now or what? Yeah, this guy again. That's cool. Whatever. Or I should leave that guy. This might be teenager or something like that. So we gotta go back and get him. Got it. Hey, Lack, wait up. Astro, what can I do for you? You have any idea what's going on around here today? I just heard from a blacksmith that you're about to go off on some adventure outside of town. Glacius hesitate, don't you? There's a reason why. You're searching for something he thinks to protect us from the darkness. And so what? You're going to go and find it for him or on your own? Not just me. Gaius is going as well. The whole thing is his idea. I should have known. You and I are both part of the town guard too, but he never lets us do anything dangerous. Still, something that can save us from the darkness. It is true, isn't it? I mean, he's not forcing you to risk your life for nothing, is he? Always casual. Hey, you said it yourself. The guy never puts us in danger. Not unless it's actually important. In either case, I'm surprised guys didn't ask me to come along. I, but I am on guard duty today. You never know when monsters might finally show up. Look, Asher, I don't need to rude, but... I know, I know. You don't want to keep guys waiting. I'll talk to you later anyway. If you really do find something out there, I bet I'll be the first one to hear about it. Good luck, and be careful, okay? Now, I wonder if they swap her for a male character if you go female, or if they... If there's even a relationship there, or if it's just a friendship thing. Huh. Wait, this is not where Gaius is. Oh yeah, that bridge that I missed earlier on. Use that again. Ready, are we leaving right away? Yes, I've been speaking to the chief some more, and I'm convinced there's no time to waste. Our destination is the ruinous fort outside of town, a few hours to the northwest. It's not a very large place. It shouldn't take long to search at all. While we are gone, Asher will be able to keep watch over the town, but still, we shouldn't dawdle. Understood. Let's get going, then. Gaius has joined your party. Cool. Oh, I have to give him points, too. Uh. 
Yeah, I don't think you can on assign points either. Okay, so we got a party. Let's party. We'll give combat a spin and then I'll probably call it there. You get the we'll get the gist here. This is the world map. From here you can travel across the Lexus Island and access different locations in the game. Go figure. While you are traveling on the world map, time will pass faster and you'll become fatigued more quickly. Okay, so resting is a matter of fatigue. This is the fort I wanted? Yep, Fort Kaiser. Well, here we are, Fort Kaiser. Founded as a charity and outpost in the days before the darkness. Now it is just a crumbling ruin. Do you really think the object this chief spoke about is hidden here? With these big on displaces, I need to hide something important. Not many would dare to tread here. We will find trouble before long. Are you prepared? As long as I've got my weapon, I'm ready as I ever am. Just be ready for battle and keep your wits about you, and you will be fine. Let us begin the search now. We don't have time to waste. Okay. While you're exploring an odd town area, you may be ambushed by enemies. Okay, so there's random battles. And it's step count based. Seems to be something strange about this wall. That I can't do anything yet. Right. That's blocked. Sparkly thing, probably a save point. Three salves. That's great salve. Also blocked. I like the dissolve. Oh, I like. The, I kind of like the first person throwback. Oh, nice shot. Feels kind of like Fantasy Star or Dragon Warrior, Dragon Quest, if you will, rather than Final Fantasy. I forgot RPG Maker had like both formats. Menu's a little slow though, that's odd. Doesn't seem to be much I can do here, unless... Oh. oh, I like the little animations, too. That's neat. For the text. I was trying to figure out what PC was, but then I realized it's a player character. Because since you can pick a guy or a girl, you can't have a single icon. They should have had, if there was a way to set it up so you could, uh... So it would set one icon for one or the other. That probably would have been a little better, but, you know. I'm not that familiar with the ins and, out of, ins and outs and our, of RP... Ins and outs of RPG Maker, so... There's that. And we got some great salve. We got stairs here. It's a block pushing puzzle. Take one healing crystal. Special key to open it. Could this be a special key? Something open on the floor above. Okay, we went downstairs. So there's levers. Okay, blocks do not get pushed. We need a special key though. So we open something. It could be that weird wall. It could be one of these little uh, doors. It is not one of these little doors. I'm gonna vote weird wall then. I see another lever, level lever there. Okay, the encounter rate's not too bad. You can get by with just kind of straight attacking here. It's not too bad. Scale mans, you getting hit.
Although apparently now my party is terrible at actually killing him. And I just realized I only have 2 HP left on him. Um, that's bad. Try not to die. Now do I get revived after the battle? No. Um... So, be more careful is basically the lesson we learned today. Alright, well, I don't know where the thing we opened is, but pretty stock fantasy RPG, but it's not awful. I do like that they have the tutorial stuff in the beginning, even though this is the sort of thing I spend most of my youth playing, so it makes sense to me. It's functional, and it's less, you know, it feels, it's not trying too hard to be self-aware, like some of the more recent ones that I haven't really enjoyed. And, uh, it looks good, it's polished, the, the feel is consistent. Um, it's alright. If you like JRPG style games, here's Legion Wood is worth a look. Thanks for watching. Top vid's old, bottom vid's new, everything else pretty self-explanatory. Big button in the middle goes to my website. There's words there. Other stuff too. Check it out. Later.